I'm going to start this video with um, with an intention. Um, I have here my kangen water. Kangen water. Oof. Wow. And the intention of this video is to somehow inspire you to somehow make you think in a different way to create more harmony and more beauty in this place because um, I think it's needed I think we all can agree that it's needed mm. so Finally, um, excuse me, um, excuse my cat, my cat, she's here and she, um, she is in her jumpy mood, so, um, yeah, the earth can shake maybe a little bit, <laughs> here and there, um, Okay, so I really, I was, I wanted to make this video for a long time. Um, and yeah, I just felt it now, like I felt it today. I just felt it now. Now, like now. I wanna, I wanna, I wanna just talk about that. Mm. Um, hmm. <laughs> okay. Uh, amor, um, uh, okay. Okay. So, uh, I, I, she, I, she's, a, she's distracting me a little bit, so if I get, I'll be like distracted, I'm just going to move her to the other room. Um, okay. So basically, performing arts right performing arts um i i wanted to talk why why i actually um felt like like okay i think i need to <laughs> i think i need to take her to another room she's really distracting me okay guys we are going to um we're going to continue with her in here because I put her in another room and she started meowing, so amazing. Okay, so basically, <laughs> let's let's uh, dive deeper into why uh, I didn't want to continue. Oh, just a second. Okay, so why I didn't want to continue... Um, my uni, okay? Why? Well, I just, I just basically um, dropped. Like I, I just, I just, I just was like, I'm going, I'm leaving, I'm leaving to, I'm going to Mexico, and um, I've been feeling like it was basically it was um, a few weeks, a month before. Um, our major project like well, I was already in the process of doing it preparing it creating it everything rehearsing um, because um, I I was studying performing arts so we were rehearsing creating everything putting together and I always put all my heart all my being into everything that I do So basically, I started drinking this water, no? I started drinking this water, no? <laughs> yes, I started drinking it. And it's very related to why it's kind of related. It was like the peak point of my decision. Um, I really want to focus on this video. And she, um, she, she um, just wants to play now. Mm. Flore Florecita! 
Flor, que? Hello? Hello? Do you want to go outside? Yes, I think you want. You want to go outside, no? I'm, I'm going to put her with other cats <laughs> uh, outside. <laughs> She's like shocked. But before I do it, I just like, <laughs> I want to... We're going to make a performance. Meow, 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 meow. Now I hope the cats won't like bully her or something. Oh my god, she already had some trauma with some cats. But why I mean like I'm like okay, she needs to learn life as well. You know guys how it is. You also had to go through this, learn life, and that's what we are going to talk about. Partly uh, after me cleaning the bed and <laughs> okay. Um, so basically, uh, <laughs> okay, so basically, you know, you need to learn life, no? You need to know the basics of life, you need to have a strong base in your own existence, in your own being, your strong frame, your strong structure, your sense of self, um, in order to to create something for other people to create right to 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 share something with people and i know that it's not always the case like you can it's it's like you don't have to be a perfect example let's say to what is a perfect example anyways we can now you know make a philosophy class in here uh, out of like out of that video um, but my point my 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 point is that you can create anything from any state of being okay you can create anything from any state of being however i just stopped resonating like i just felt like my journey ended okay and it didn't end with receiving a paper that i graduated so um, this is for that was for me graduation. What happened with me and the water and a lot of different things, because it was a process and it wasn't just the water, but the water triggered uh, the the sense of end, um, like before the actual graduation. Mm. So what I wanted to say is that. I just stopped resonating with being part of something that in its roots, in its structure is, is not coherent, is not coherent, is not, um, is not strong, is like that the intention didn't feel right to me because what I, what is my intention towards people, what I create is was sometimes very different to what i've been faced with in that reality of like university reality okay so uh, i don't want to say that it's bad it's not bad like everything uh, is an opportunity everything is is just uh, there for people and we can make choices right however guys I just need to speak my truth like this is my truth because sometimes like I, sometimes you can get lost in a lot of different truths right and I have like the ability I don't know what about you 
maybe you are one of those people like me that has the ability to see everything from infinite perspectives and like you know that every perspective is like the right perspective because there's no wrong and right but like I I need to speak from my truth okay and I don't want to look at other perspectives because I know they exist and I know they're right like they if something works for someone it just works and that's it uh, but I'm going to share my truth, okay? This is my truth and what feels right to me in this moment, in this lifetime, in, in all the time, okay? So in general, during this year, there was like a huge crisis uh, in, in my, my, like my group of people, in my course. Uh, I don't know about the rest. I, I, I don't know, like, but I know. I know that there is a lot of transformation in terms of systems like that like academic world and all that it's there is a lot of transformation so people can come back to beingness to creating um from a place of beingness just being a human um or not a human maybe you don't feel like a human <laughs> but this is your current form uh now and and if, and and creating from a place of like wholeness right wholeness feeling complete aligned healthy and and adding on to adding um adding something into like to this world that brings value right that brings value to 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 have a healthier and more harmonious uh environment and everything everything system environment uh, mental health body everything every kind of system this is as well our system our body and mind is a system that you can program that you can that you can um transmute transform everything <laughs> um so observing being part of it it was for me a huge journey those four years of studying uh and i've went through a lot of transformation myself obviously like we all constantly evolve and transform so that was for me my own transformation, exploring performing arts, exploring the depths of my emotions and, and like just like I love performing arts. I just love it. Um, um, and I will always love performing arts. That's why I'm here in Mexico. Also is a part of my journey. So I didn't stop, but I just I didn't stop exploring life life and performance and everything all my intentions however i didn't want to be a part of this specific system anymore i just it was triggered like the the end the, the, the decision that like that's it was triggered by the kangen water okay by the kangen water so bear with me um and <clears throat> that was the trigger however it it started before it was like a transformation a lot of shifts in the world like we all know what's been happening in the past two years and in general like it's a lot of transformations shifts and people awakening uh, and i explore that on this channel as well what does it mean like to awaken what does it mean to when the consciousness rises within you awakens i explore all those things in here um presence right the power of presence manifestation everything and we will keep exploring exploring that so basically um basically the whole year the whole year was the academic year right so like from 2021 to 2022 i had like constantly like suddenly doubts suddenly doubts because I went through a huge, huge shift energetically and spiritually um, in the summertime prior to like starting, like prior to the last academic year. And a lot of people like also went through those shifts um, because we are doing it collectively. And I talk about that on this channel, how we collectively shift, manifest and transform and transmute the old limitations. So 
so basically um, me and a lot of different people from my course started feeling like we kind of like lost a sparkle um, related to to creating cre like to creating performances um, yeah to just creating to just creating performances to just creating and being part of it no so the sparkle wasn't lost towards performing arts the sparkle was lost because of the base and the intention of this system of this environment and i just realized it so so much i just was like processing it and i'm like grateful for uh i'm grateful for this experience i'm grateful for um for having that four years of experience that was like beautiful powerful like amazing um it's just like for me it was that's it like i cannot be part of something that the intention is not coherent and because i have my vision my intention and i i just was like observing like i just kept studying i was observing the people i was observing the opportunities what we can create and all that and being part of it and and finally like i i when i'm when i decide to stay somewhere which i did like i continued studying i i like do my best to be there i do my best to um to create something beautiful so i kept like i had some doubts here and there sometimes that kept coming back kept coming back but those doubts didn't affect the quality of um, like my work and the, the way i was doing things uh, and we we created some really amazing performances and i was really really excited to to create the performance for final major project i was very very excited and and just and just this i was in the process of creating this performance like it, which happened in may uh last month this changed everything it made me want to be in here I, I it was like a pull like i am supposed to be here i'm supposed to be here in mexico i am i know i need to be here it was like energetically spiritually mentally physically on every possible level like here marta like here you're going to create here and and it's it's like i know that the journey continues and everything that i that, uh, that is showing up in my life and I'm manifesting in here is related to my intention. So I want to come back because I started saying something that my intention in there finished. Like it was like, that's it. I have clarity. This brought me clarity. Okay. This brought me clarity. Candle water, alkaline water. I'll be sharing more about this water. This is a powerful transformational tool um, and the intention in at university was not coherent I was like I have my vision I have my t intention I want to work with people who are coherent with my intention who are in harmony with my intention who has the same intention that the base need to be the same like the base of what you create needs to be the same like the people need to come together and create in oneness and you know guys like university environment is very specific like people are late people are lazy people are not committed sometimes they they, they are there but they are not there and like i cannot create like that like i cannot create like that this is one thing one thing that made me like made me decide like that's it like that's it Another thing was like that I observed a lot of things, very strange things uh, at uni and because I, I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm an artist but like I also 
I'm so interested in like health, body, mental health, like mind, mind, the power of our mind, like everything connected to spirituality, like science also, I'm not, I'm like open to everything, right? So I just saw uh, a lot of beauty in this environment, a lot of beauty because I want to always see the positive side um, and that's amazing, but there, there was just like, something that wasn't clicking anymore and it wasn't clicking for i think it wasn't clicking for a long time but i was just hey i just had a journey i just had a process in there just it was meant to be that way and um, and and i i just kept creating with those with those like doubts sometimes right just the system of like grading and the way everything functions in there for me it's like very it's just like very ego driven for me art should be transcendental for me art should be something that transforms someone that is transcendental that is creating more harmony right and and, and just like I'm not saying that there was n nothing nothing that was like beautiful once again in this in this system but it's just like the energy the energy like the the attitude of people um, the the base the basic the basic like the basic base the base, the roots were not like resonating with me. We're not resonating with me. Like people were creating from unhealthy mindset, from like, from like, from from like um, very very incoherent place. I think this is, this is the word incoherent place, and that is not a bad thing, guys. Like art is art. Art can also heal a lot of things, transform a lot of things. So that is completely fine like I'm not saying that is bad or something but it wasn't for me I'm talking about my truth it was not coherent because I already was like I know I know what I want to create and here I have some opportunities but I no longer resonate like I no longer resonate with the approach with the with the system with like people uh, sometimes that Mm, I it's just I don't want to talk about I don't want to talk badly about like people but just thinking about my intention and creation not like as friends because like as a human I can be like compassionate towards that person right I can understand how they feel and blah blah, blah. but like on a professional level on a level of like co-creating I'm like I cannot accept like I can accept, but I got tired of people with bad attitude and like laziness and being late. So that was like the, 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 the main reason. That was the main reason. Just like, what am I, what am I doing here? Like, what am I doing here? Like I want to co-create with people who are willing to put their energy and effort and time and the right intention to co-create and that and that's perfectly fine and i'm just like accepting everything as it is so i'm like okay I, that's my journey ended like those people can be there i'm for me it ended um also together with a lot of experiences connected to this amazing water uh just a second uh just like the light is slightly different now so um that is that is the thing um but yeah it was still beautiful the journey was still beautiful um i just needed also i just needed also like that was a point in my life that i really needed to just like feel free to feel free to to flow to just be present um 
and yeah, and create from a, from like a strong intention, create from a place of integrity for other people, create performances from a place of strong integrity and like deeply rooted um, alignment, alignment. So that is art for me. Art is serving us for to express ourselves obviously to heal to transform but yeah for me for me um like i'll give you an example okay for me i'll give you an example like um a performer right a performer that interacts with people a performer that interacts with people and like holds a space on the stage to trans to to transmit something powerful needs to have a strong sense of integrity and in and in like be aligned in order to transmit a strong energy like to transmit the right intention right and that is my truth okay that is my truth and i don't want to look at other perspectives for now i don't want to like i see other perspectives that is my ability to to like look from other people's eyes perspective uh, but this is my truth and i'm going to stick to this i'm going to stick with that because uh otherwise it's just a mess um so that is that is one thing so so imagine that it's like they imagine that a performance, like you go to watch a performer for performance, and there is like things are happening, a nice story, blah blah, physical theater, um, and I don't know, like people are um, telling the story through their body, uh, and it's all amazing and beautiful. However, the performer itself, in his day to day life, uh, in his own life, like doesn't have a doesn't have a sense of self like um does is not aligned is not like doesn't have is not like i really i'm repeating this word but for me integrity is something really powerful integrity so for example we had workshops right we had workshops um and that is for me like that was for me like those workshops were amazing amazing like so amazing like so i was so grateful for this person to come and to have those workshops with me and that is another thing that i think i was like sick of i was like tired i was like no more like no more um <laughs> that people were so unappreciative of being there of studying it of of just like appreciating that the, someone comes and like leads beautiful workshops for them and and just like all the time like uh and complaining and you guys what like i just started i just you can get crazy in this in that environment you can start absorbing this energy like i was like no i don't i just like i don't want to continue working with um such energy you know uh so imagine that we had like workshops, right? We had workshops and some performers, um, some performers were not r like able to be in full presence in their body, mind and like look at other people's eyes very deeply. Like just stare at people's eyes very deeply and just interact with full presence, with full like, um, with full um, engagement. And then we were talking with the teacher and I loved those workshops. Me and my other friend, we just loved it. We were like, damn it, those workshops were powerful. Uh, and like a lot of people, and everyone was complaining, 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 all the time complaining about everything. And I'm like, what the fuck is going on in here? Like, I'm here four years and I'm like, I, I just take all the best from those the, that university, but I'm like sick of this complaining and people not appreciating 
like the creation, the performing arts, like creating from a place of just like, I don't know, misalignment. And that is my truth, guys. It's, uh, it's harsh. <laughs> like it can seem harsh, but that is, this is my truth. This is my truth. I need to say it. I need to say it. This is my truth. Um, and I'm not saying that, oh, okay, I'm like so amazing now, but well, I think I am amazing actually. And I, I think everyone is amazing. And I think everyone has the potential to, um, to, to realign, to like really feel good inside in order to go and create for other people. Okay, because if you want to go and create for the people, from what place are you creating? This is the question. From what place are you creating if you are an artist, right? Mm. So yeah, I just... Um, yeah, I just wanted to share that. Um, I don't know if I shared everything. It was just like accumulation of m all my observations, all my kind of like insights and what I want in my life and what I want to experience in my life and and yes and that, that is it that is it and we started um, what I want to say that we started like my major project we started creating a really amazing project um, amazing performance um, and as well, like a lot of challenges, like people didn't want to be part of it, didn't want to commit, um, didn't want to concentrate on the creation. And that was like, I was like so committed. I was like, I'm going to create this performance and then, I'm, then, then I'll, I'll leave to Mexico. Then, I'll, then I'm leaving because I, I wanted to go anyways. So I just knew that I'm going to do this performance and then like, complete and, and leave <laughs> but this water changed the plans because time is not linear and I talk about that here on this channel time is not linear creation happens in the present moment so we can think oh this is what's going to happen and like yes it can happen but maybe there is something better that is going to happen that is something even more aligned that it's going to happen and it's related to your intention so the point is that when you manifest you just have to keep the vision keep the intention strong and then i was thinking okay i'm going to create this performance because it's part of my my intentions like i i want to co-create with and like perform and all that and and then and then like life showed me that there is something better there is something better waiting for me somewhere else and i'm just realizing now uh like being here um like seven weeks i think seven weeks everything that that was happening and what i was manifesting is like damn damn there is a huge potential in here of co-creating and diving deep into different aspects of performing arts um, so this water guys if you are new to this channel like you don't know what I'm talking about you can check my other videos mm, but I'm going to but I'm going to say like I'm going to say a couple of words about this water so basically mm, I started drinking this water um, one month before leaving mm, England and they say that the first month is very crucial and during the first month you go through like a, the, the biggest transformation in your body, mind and in your whole, like your whole reality changes, your whole life changes. Um, and that, that it was really the case because like literally one month after starting drinking this water, I, I landed in here. Um, so this water really started showing me the truth about everything because water consciousness it's consciousness okay it's consciousness water is leading us in our ascension the consciousness of water 
it's it's just beyond. I just it's just beyond our my my comprehension. I'm just going to drink. Okay. So this water. This water started showing me the truth about everything. Um, it just, you just see, you just see the reality. You just, well, the reality. You just basically, basically go through internal processes and you start seeing everything differently. You just start seeing everything differently because you start hydrating yourself. Hydrogen, right? Hydrogen is pure love. And all your cells, when all your cells are hydrated, you can see yourself, yourself, your cells are hydrated. You start awakening to the love, to the presence, to the, to the infinite possibilities. Um, and, and that is something, um, that is something so beautiful that um, we as wakers, we are called wakers, Wake water movement, wake water movement, we wakers talk about, right? We talk about that. Um, so, so basically, um, if you are interested, I'm just, it just came to me now that if you're interested in getting, like getting to know more about this water and this machine, it's a machine that is an ionizer. Um, it has a lot of different options. Um, if you if you are interested, you can also comment if you want. Uh, leave your email or something that you're interested, and I am able to like invite you for webinars, and you can study um, like the scientific side of this machine, this water, this movement in general, what it offers, what is it all about, the vision of this movement. Uh, that is spreading like all over the world, uh, awakening the like people, like really taking care of the environment and just living in full potential. Uh, so that is uh, what you can do. Um, so basically, yeah, this this machine um, is changing the structure of this water. So what 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 happens when you drink structured water? You completely it's just basically basically huh the the water that you're drinking let's say that way the water that you're drinking uh, from a lot of different places you can charge with your intention energy and all that okay because water cannot be technically like never is like that like dead it's always like alive but it's um, a stagnant water right it's a stagnant water um, because it's not structured, okay? So if you uh, start drinking structured water, you basically, it's, it's called the living water, living water, so structured, structured water can be found in fruits and vegetables, okay? Structured water, fruits and vegetables. That's why I always say it's a lot of them, like all the colors, it's this is structured water, it's going to structure your, everything in your life, it's going to structure your inner being. It's going to change the like the harmony in your entire body. So um, yeah, it just crazy things happen when you start drinking structured water. Um, basically, all the you just you just you just tran transform and heal all the limitations. You start seeing the truth. Um, the water holds memory of like. The beginning of the universe the water holds memory of everything it's everything you start channeling informations um about everything you just gain clarity it's just it's just a power powerful i can i can i could talk about water uh more and i i really wanted to make a separate video about this machine because um because yeah this this video i wanted to be about performing arts and like why it didn't resonate anymore with with the academic academic world. Yeah, I just didn't. 
Um, so, guys. What else I uh, would like to say? This water. Wow. Obviously, like, it's not also about being like attached to this water because like the past weeks I actually had a break from this water because um, my filtration is taking ages to arrive um, and and yeah and basically I don't want to go into de in depth into that but I stopped drinking it and it's also like I detached from like two weeks from this water or more and I feel amazing so it's also like it's also a nice process like what this water is telling you, is showing you. It's like a whole journey with this water. It's like a process of like detaching from the machine. Okay, detaching from the machine. is like the water is teaching you to, in general, like detach from anything that is not serving you. In general, detach. Because you don't need to be attached to something to have it in your life. You don't have to be attached to things to have them. It's, it's like actually the opposite. When you detach, you attract more okay that is the secret of manifestation when you detach the more you detach the more you uh, attract because you're a magnet to, to all the things um th that your essence wants to manifest you just are not like <sighs> i need it because that's an energy of lack it's an energy of lack and when you are in the energy of lack you attract lack so guys, um, yeah, I had a huge process of, of like activation within my body. I already spoke about that mind and everything all my life with this water, a lot of processes. So, um, so yeah, so I really want to thank you for this video. Thank you for being here. Uh, thank you. Thank you. Thank you for being here. And and yeah, let's create a lot of art. That is my intention. Let's create a lot of art that is very deeply rooted in alignment, in integrity. Art that is transcendental, okay? Art that activates, brings harmony, and all the good things, and heals, and all the good things. So that is the intention of this video. Um, that's why I wanted to share, um, yeah, just my insights about university systems and like, yeah, um, creating art from a broken place, okay? Creating art from a place of not knowing yourself and and being um, being like a bit, yeah, just, just yeah misaligned <laughs> let's call it that way misaligned not a little bit but like a lot no in some cases so um, so yeah um i really came to me now again uh that i already mentioned that in some of my videos that i talk about like oneness consciousness on this channel right and like tapping into the creative powers and the presence the, the power of the presence and everything um, and three-dimensional rea reality, five-dimensional reality like all those things so we can explore that and what came to me now is that in the three-dimensional reality uh, the, the like judgment, right? the judgment is needed it's needed to under like we need judgment to understand the structure of three-dimensional reality Okay, it's like the judgment is part of the three-dimensional reality, and and you can accept that and and still still like um, judge things and be like, okay, this is what I like, this is what I don't like, this is what resonates, this is what resonates, and yet at the same time, like living from oneness, from five-dimensional reality, which is creating from the inside out okay so you create from the inside out but in the three-dimensional reality external reality there is an element of judgment and yeah i really want to say that because i have a strong sense of like justice within me 
and sometimes as I mentioned in the beginning of the video I just see like all the perspectives like everyone's perspectives I know like I understand how they feel what they see everything but at the end of the day we need to always come back to our truth okay what is resonating with us what is resonating with us what is our truth because this ability is helpful in some moments of your life okay in some aspects of your life but in other moments it can um, it can just mess up with you and I already experienced this guys so that's why I'm sharing it okay um, cool thank you and all the best beautiful souls um, and this human body <laughs> or whatever I don't know from which galaxy or planet um, you came and I don't know so thank you so much for this video and keep shining your light um, yeah life life is a performance just enjoy uh, the beauty of feeling things of being alive of create creating okay thank you so much